And then Metu. He ain't going to miss. And if, like many in our conference here, the Pac-12 trying to blend in a whole bunch of new faces That's like right. Aaron. That's the more confident they get as the game goes on, they're playing with great energy right now, New Orleans is. Oh, and a nice little step in there. On the other side of the rim. See, I'd like to see McLaughlin go a little faster with that. And Aaron drills a three. Because they all understood. They understood the significance. And Elijah Stewart. There is a deep three. Well, USC taking a lot of threes early here. And now on the out, there's Elijah Stewart back. Clean block. There's, there's so much churn in the sport yeah. right now. I don't know if it'll change, but right now, everybody churns. We do other stuff, but I, I have to wait. Melton out ahead and transition. I wait. I just think they're flying under the radar a little bit this year. Well, they've got a good coach. That's right. right. And there's finally Bo Wright knocks one down after four misses. If you want yeah. his Bo Wright to start turning down shots. Oh, Stewart's got the baseline three. <laughs> and in the finish is Aaron and one. But if you had a chance, and I did, I drove through their campus in 2007 and again in 2008. Don't foul him. Nope. And Melton goes in there. And They've been for I don't know how many years. And I think their rank, if you went back and looked at their preseason rankings, they're oh, oh, great catch and finish by Melton. Did her running something for him Brand. to make sure he gets an attempt or two it's McLaughlin in that's what he's so good at he and again all of this was a uh, one-sided game here at home tonight they did get a nice world win a good one for the conference as well as for the Trojans in their last game at